Hey, this is John. Welcome to this AI Wise Mind review and how you can use this software to create um, automated websites for um, online business and sales. So welcome to my channel. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. Now I want you to watch this video all the way through because we're going to talk about basically three different things. I'm going to show you what the website does based on the sales page because they have great information on the sales page. You can learn a ton. And so we're going to just walk through that and I'll show you exactly what it does. And then I'm going to take you into the software and show you what it does. And then I'm going to show you an example site that I've made. So make sure you watch all the way through this entire video. Uh, also, I did want you to know, <clears throat> we'll jump on over to the sales page. I was a beta tester for this software. And so it has, um, uh, it was great when I became a beta tester for it. It worked flawless. It worked really well. And the people behind it have continued to uh, improve it. Um, they take feedback from users and they are making this better and better and better. So um, I, I just want to say it's very well supported. This is not something you're going to buy and they're going to, you know, leave you high and dry after you purchase it. I do have several other AI um software that I use, and I got to say, this is hands down the simplest way to generate content, um, informational content, uh, product re review content, etc. So let's jump in here. Um, I guess last thing I was going to say, so after we did the beta testing, they did a um, kind of a pre-launch um, to his existing customer base. Um, and so I did go ahead and, you know, get my own account at that time. And I've been using it since, which I'll show you once we, in a minute once we get inside the software. Um, and now it's you know open to the public. And again, continuing to upgrade it even after the, the internal launch. So uh, this is basically what it does. This is for creating um, blog content, website content for really any niche, any niche you can think of. Okay, if you want to get into whatever, cars, pets, um, farm equipment, um, you know, bowling, <laughs> whatever you can think of, you can use the software for. Yeah, it's SEO friendly. Um, basically what it does, it integrates with OpenAI. So you need an OpenAI API key and they provide full training. So you, you will see all the training. Okay. Um, when you come here to the sales page and there's a link in the description box below to get you over here to the sales page, you can read through some of these example articles. When you click on it, it'll open up and you can read the quality. Okay. And these are unedited. These are just how they come out. Um, so you can do Amazon product review articles. You can just do informational articles. You can do roundup reviews where you can say, I want it to write an article and compare these three different products. Um, or you can use, you can do a product from any other affiliate commission site, ClickBank, ShareASale, Commission Junction, any other affiliate commission site you can make a product review for. Um, they got some testimonials on here. These are from people inside the uh, WiseMind Facebook group. Um, and then uh, why is it different? So basically AI WiseMind is the software that uh, through the OpenAI API will generate the software. And it, it, they've, you know, programmed AI WiseMind with all the different prompts that it needs to create these articles. So you don't have to cut, try to go in there yourself and do that. And so it is kind of just a set and forget. Now you do have the ability to edit it, the article if you want. So uh, you do have full control over the article. Uh, but it really is set and forget, and um, 95 to really 100% of the article can be used as is typically once it's done. Um, we'll go in and look in the software in a second. So what does it do? Okay, so it has a site wizard. Basically, if, if as long as you have a brand new WordPress install, you can go through the site wizard and it'll create all your like legal pages. It'll create your categories for your site. It'll install... Um, they got a list of plug WordPress plugins you can choose from to install. And so it really, you know, in just a few minutes has your WordPress site set up with legal pages, uh, menu, and some essential plugins. You can connect all your WordPress sites uh, to it. So um, they show you how to get that done. You can also create what are called site groups. So just say you're in the health and fitness niche and you have several um, maybe websites that talk about weight loss. Okay. You could 
say you have three websites that talk about weight loss. You could put those three different sites into a site group, and then when you generate articles, you could say you want those articles sent out to that group. So you don't have to do it for each individual site. You can do a group. It's also good for creating private blog networks, if that's something you wanted to do. Um, it'll auto-add or auto-embed <coughs> YouTube videos and uh, images. And so those are helpful because YouTube videos really help. Number one, just keep your post engaging, but it's also really good for SEO. Um, so that's super helpful. So it goes out to YouTube, finds a keyword relevant video, and pulls it in. Um, you can customize your content. You can, you know, the tone of voice, how long you want the article to be, the language. If you want GTP 3.5 versus 4, you can choose that. So you have a lot of customization available. You can uh, have your post scheduled either immediately or you can schedule it. You can say, I want, um, you know, five posts per day for the next 10 days. I want one post a day for the next 30 days. I want one post you know, a week for the next six months, you, you can schedule it pretty much however you want. You do have full ability to edit your content. Um, and the nice thing is because it updates and syncs, you can have it go ahead and publish it. And then when you later, you can go in and edit it right within AI WiseMind. So you don't have to go to the site to edit it. You can edit it from within AI WiseMind, and then you can um, update it. It'll update it on your site. So that is another really helpful thing. You don't have to. So again, if you have 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 websites out there, you don't have to go and log into each one to edit the content. You can edit it right from within AI Wise Mind and then just hit update and it'll update it on the site. Um, you can manage your articles. They have a list of everything in here. You can go in here and edit, delete, uh, etc. But it's all stored in your dashboard. You can share articles. So if you're doing client work and maybe a client wants an article about, you know, whatever, um, the 10 benefits of the keto diet, you can have AI Wise Mind create the article and then you can share a unique link so they can look at the article and let you know if, if it's appropriate um, for them or not. You can download articles. So if you're selling articles to clients or you're doing PLR, et cetera, you can use it for that. Uh, multiple languages. We'll take a look at those in a second. This is a new feature that just came out recently, internal linking. This is really helpful for SEO and ranking is to link to other uh, posts on your website. And so that helps a lot. And that's what it'll do if you turn that option on is it'll scan you know, go through your web, other posts on your website, find other related uh, posts, and link internally to those posts. Okay, and that helps a ton. And this is a feature that's coming where you can sync YouTube channels to your site, and then it'll go out, it'll take that YouTube transcript of the video and create posts based on that video. Um, they have a great demo, you know, kind of just a good full overview here on the sales page. You may want to check that out. Um, and then you can do Amazon product reviews. Again, you can see full articles here, as well as these different informational articles. They have great training, shows you exactly how to get everything set up, how to use it, the different situations, etc. And then finally, here is the pricing. Now you do, this is the monthly cost uh, for AI, AI Wise Mind. And that, as it says, it does not include your open AI costs. Now, on average, you're gonna spend maybe one to four cents per article if you use the GPT 3.5. If you use GPT 4, it tends to be about 10 times that cost, so maybe 10 to 14 cents um, per article, not one to four cents. But GPT 3.5 does a pretty good job. You can always use GTP 4 if you want. So here's our different plans. They do have this kind of base plan, which allows you to create articles, but it does not connect to your websites or sync to your websites or create Amazon product reviews, okay? Um, so this is basically just to create information articles only, and you can create up to 500. But if you're just, you know, if you're a freelancer and you're um, selling articles, then this might be, you know, a good way to do it, um, you know, to use to go with this plan. Or if you just want to, you know, have um, a, a wise mind create the article, and then if you want to copy and paste it into your WordPress site, you could do that, and that's a pretty gar darn good deal for you know 500 articles per month. Twelve dollars is cheap. Now, the plans that do auto sync to your site and get you can where you can schedule posts, update them, you know, add all your uh, sites, unlimited sites, etc. 
that is going to be starting at $37 a month for um, 100 articles. And then 250 articles, $67 a month. 500 articles, $97 a month. 1,250 articles a month, 197 And then 3,000 articles, 300 All pretty reasonable. Um, uh, again, that does not include your open AI costs, but really pretty reasonable for what you're getting. And some reviews. And that is it. So, oh, some frequent asked questions. You know, so a lot of people, you know, these, there's these AI detectors out there. Um, to be honest, they're all kind of a joke. You know, Google does not penalize AI content as long as it's useful and um, helpful. That's really what they want. They want useful, helpful content. And so, you know, use, worrying about AI detection, really, I wouldn't worry about that at all. Um, you can upgrade or downgrade at any time. Um, uh, so AI Wise Mind is what allows you to, you know, create the content and auto post it and sync it, edit it, etc. to your website. So that's the software. OpenAI is the engine that um, is used to create the content. Now, they create it only based on the prompts that come from AI Wise Mind. Let me say it that way. Um, and so that's why you need to pay for both AI Wise Mind and uh, have an OpenAI account. Um, Yes, you need your open open AI open a, AI API key. It's super easy to create. Um, the unused posts do not roll over each month. Okay, so you want to make sure you go in and use them up every month. Just make sure you got enough scheduled. Yes, you can use it for clients, uh, image usage rights. Um, you know, it will it'll pull from different sources. So, you know, you can uh, use your Pixabay API. You can use. Um, it'll pull Amazon products for Amazon reviews, etc. You can definitely use it with existing sites, and the articles range from 800 to 3,000 words. All right, so enough of the sales page. Let's jump into my account. So here's my account, um, and you can see. Let me just jump over, put myself over here. Uh, these were some that I just did, you know, in the, within the past day because my um, I had like 20 some articles left um, that weren't going to roll over. So I said, let me get knock these out, right? So um, I do have a coffee website. That's the example I'm going to show you. So, you know, I did an Amazon uh, product, an informational product, uh, Amazon product review, an informational post, and a couple, another Amazon product review, right? So you can view, uh, um, this will open up the article that was created. Uh, or, I'm sorry, the, the campaign. Um, Let's just go back here. We don't. We'll go. I'll show you. I'll just open up a new campaign. Uh, show you how you would create one, and then you can edit the campaign. And so you can see I have lots and lots of campaigns in here. Um, again, just because part of you know part of this came from when I was doing the beta testing, and so and then I've been using it as well since it left beta testing. So it's taking a little bit of time to upload all my campaigns, but you can see lots and lots of campaigns. Um, so this is all the content that it has created so far and you're going to see it's it's a variety 261 pieces of content that I've created so far. Um, you can oh this one didn't work for some reason so you could always try to rerun it and see what happened. Um, and so here you go the vegan instant pot cookbook it's an it's an Amazon um, product review that's the type of post it is about 1500 words that was published 21 hours ago. Um, here's another vegan recipe book, 1353 words that was published, another vegan cookbook. Um, here's a Amazon Real Good Coffee Company product review, 1540. And so you can see these are quite, uh, very quite a bit. Let me go back to some of my earlier posts. Just so you'll see some informational posts here. Oh, I guess these are all Amazon as well. Let's, um, <laughs> Let's get a little different look. Um, so I'm going to kind of show you an informational post, which I guess if we hop over to my website. So here's uh, one of my sites, Coffee Verb. This is a coffee site. Um, and when you come down, you know, here's latest posts, right? So let me show you, open this up and show you what. Uh, this is an Amazon product review. And so here you go. So it pulled the images. You know, this is the title. And if you're looking for a delicious, sustainable way to start your day, then you need to get your hands on the Real Good Coffee Company's 
whole bean coffee breakfast bland light roast coffee beans okay so you see it's very well written content i have not edited this at all and then here it links you know these are buttons so you, you can choose from with your amazon link and then it just goes through and it you know, talks about some of the highlights as you go to uh, here it pulled um, a youtube video in um, these are the product specs off of amazon um, again some images some pros and cons some faqs so you can see it makes a very nice post, okay? And then get it on Amazon. Um, this is gonna be another, let's go to the home page here. Let's go inside our information. This is, these are all informational posts. So tips for making a cappuccino without a machine, okay? And so this pulled in information, um, you know, make sure you get grind the beans coarsely for best results, tools you're going to need, preparing your coffee, tips for making it without a machine, frothing the milk, choose your milk, heat the milk in a saucepan, use a frother. So again, you know, it just, this is informational only, but you can see it really does a nice job putting all that information out there. Um, and then again, a lot of these are just, you know, product reviews. So if we go in, let's just show you real quick. Uh, so again, you know, Site Wizard to create your site. Here's your tutorials, your settings where you add in your API keys, and then um, you know connecting your sites or if you have any site groups. But let's go to campaigns, and I'm just going to kind of walk you through how you would set up a campaign. I hit my limit for the month, so unfortunately I can't run the campaign. But we'll go ahead and just kind of walk through so you can see how it is done. So that's going to upload and uh, load in just a second okay new campaign and basically the first thing you're going to do oh yeah see it says I hit my limit so it's not even going to let me <laughs> um, create a campaign but you can see it's going to renew in 18 hours okay so I can't even show you how to set up a campaign unfortunately um, you can you can definitely see it somewhat on the I would encourage you to go through the demo because, uh, you know, Chris shows you how to do that for sure on the demo. And then also you can kind of see here, basically you have three types of campaigns to choose from. Information, which is just, like it says, it's just information about a topic. An Amazon product review. And if you choose to do that, you can either do a single product review or multiple products where you want to maybe compare three or four or five products. And then the, the product review, that would be for anything, a product that's not an Amazon product. So it could be a ClickBank product, a ShareASale product, etc. cetera. Um, you can, you know, here's where you name your campaign. This is where you put in keywords. So you could, you know, get a bunch of keywords, you know, maybe um, how to start a keto diet for a beginner. Maybe that's your keyword, okay? You can put in multiple keywords. You can also, let's say we're doing an article about keto diet, right? You could put in multiple keywords. You could out, go out and find um, you could go to Google and find websites that have articles and you could put the website URL in here, multiple URLs if you want, and it'll go out and it'll pull the information from those article, from those other sites, rewrite them, um, to make articles. Uh, since this is an Amazon, you'd put in your Amazon ID. Um, if you want to add video embeds and images, you click those, um, choose your, uh, GPT 3.4, 3.5 or 4, the point of view, uh, usually second person and either conversational or friendly works well. The length of the article, which can be up to 3,000 words, and then the language you want it in. And there's some, a few other options you can't see here, but I would encourage you to go and watch this demo video um, that they have here on the sales page, which will definitely walk you through the entire thing. Uh, again, the link is down below, so I'd encourage you to go check this out. It's actually very reasonable pricing for what this does. It, um, I paid higher monthly pricing for AI programs that don't do nearly as much as AI WiseMind does. So I hope you found this helpful. If so, please like the video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And uh, I'm going to be making additional videos about AI WiseMind as well. Thanks for watching.